Hi, I'm Mark Huddleston, and today we're bringing you a, a home to uh, showcase, and you'll be able to go on a walking tour with me through the house. We're in beautiful North Glen. We're only a few blocks from the I-25 freeway and the 104 off-ramp, so it's convenient to go into Denver or here in the North End area. Uh, the home that you'll see behind me is a low-maintenance home. It's brick. Uh, that has got dual-pane windows, hardwood floors. Uh, it's a three bedrooms upstairs. There is a basement bedroom and a basement playroom and a game room area. There's also a downstairs huge laundry area. And we'll be walking through the home and showcasing that. You'll see over to the right hand side that there's a carport uh, area that they're using as a patio. And there's plenty of room to the right, a uh, huge area off to the side that you could build a garage or you could even put a garage in back. So it's got a large yard in the back and we'll be seeing all that today. Again, for $149.9, it's three bedrooms up. There's a bedroom in the basement. There's plenty of room and it's low maintenance. We're about a quarter block from the school, which is right at the end of the block here. And um, it's a short walk, but it's far enough away where you don't get the kid noise. So it's a great location. They're shopping just a block that way. There's a, uh, two blocks, there's a Walmart, there's a Gander Mountain, there's theaters. So we're kind of in a little quiet area here of beautiful, well-maintained homes. And um, let's go inside now and we'll do a tour. Okay, now we're going to go inside. There's the front bay window and the mailbox slot with the brick. Here's the front door and we'll come on in. As you can see, um, it's nice and bright in here. I don't know if this camera is doing it justice. It has real hardwood floors, as you can see. And it has a, a window right there. And then here's the, the, the view off of the front, which is really nice. You have the big tree. Of course, it's um, towards the end of winter, but you don't have any leaves on it. But a beautiful shade tree out front. Very, very quiet neighborhood. Okay. Now here, we're going to walk from the living room into the kitchen. Um, you can see there was upgraded oak cabinets recently put in. And lots of counter space. So you can kind of see that. That door there goes out to the backyard and down to the basement off of the kitchen. And then you can kind of see a little breakfast nook area here. Okay, now we'll walk back down the hallway. And you'll be able to see there's a linen closet here to the right. And let me go to the first bedroom. You can see the bedroom. Really pretty light fixtures. I know the camera won't do that justice because it'll light it out but it's got pretty flowers on there and then here's the closet doors nice wood the bathroom here was remodeled you can see the oak cabinetry and has tile floors and you can see that it has a jetted tub which is nice tile so this is all really nice all of the windows through the house were changed to dual pane so that's very nice for winterization here's an office another bedroom they're using as an office so you can kind of see plenty of windows it gets quite a lot of light okay again it's all hardwood floors out now we're going to go to the third bedroom and you can see here nice windows hardwood floors again. Okay, now we're going to, I'll meet you back downstairs. Okay, now I'm coming downstairs right here. This is the railing and I'm down at the bottom of the stairs and I'm turning right here and you'll see down here there's a shower stall and bathroom down here. Again, there's these are linoleum tiles here, but they look like real tiles down in the basement. And this was remodeled. Porcelain fixture knobs and new fixtures. Here is the basement, and they've kind of used this as a 
game room, you can see the wood paneling. But I look back that way. This could be divided into two rooms. The camera won't do it justice, but it's fairly large down here. And there's an opening there. But this could be a, a room. She had it divided before, but opened it up for a playroom. And then I'm walking over the other side of the room here. You can see they have a TV down here. And some games. And then they have another area where they play cards and stuff. But this could be three rooms here. You know, separate. Uh, rooms, uh, good size, you know, bedroom size rooms. Now let me go back down this way in the basement and then over to the right here's another bedroom. So this is what they're claiming is the fourth bedroom. Now this is non-conforming because uh, it does have a window but I wouldn't consider that a crawl, crawl out window. You know, an emergency I could get through there no problem um, and go right out but uh, maybe an elderly person wouldn't, so you really can't classify this as a as a bedroom, but although it's here. And there's a closet there. Here's the downstairs. It's uh, storage and laundry and a deep sink. You can see she's got a lot of stuff stored here because she's planning on moving. She's starting to pack up, but this is a huge area. You can see the furnace is clean as a whistle. Um, and it has a new water heater down here, high efficiency water heater, just put in in uh, last year, not even a year old. So that's the downstairs. So I'll meet you back up and we'll go see the side yard and the outside. Okay, now we're walking outside from the side yard, off the side where the kitchen is. And you see it has this large covered patio. It almost looks like it was a carport. You can see it's fairly wide. Concrete slab there. And the fence line, you know, there's probably 20 feet or so from this fence on the side over to the property. And you can see large backyard area. I'll go to the back of the house now. You can see it's nice. The neighbors are all nice. It's very private back here. You can see it's got brick uh, siding there. And then this is looking back from the backyard. Let me kind of walk to the back. Kind of see where everything is. It's got a beautiful front yard too. So that's the side yard and I'll meet you inside. <coughs> I still got to go out there.
just uh, just close to the freeway for commuting or just for access. It's close to shopping and the school is just down the street. So this house has it all. Uh, please give me a call if you'd uh, like to have a private showing.